show me your badge and so I can see who you are. Oh, my name is uh, McDonald Mariga. I'm a Kenyan international football player. <laughs> that is uh, my alter ego then is um, I'm Thorsten Kiefer from Wash United. Okay. And um, so what have we got here? What do you do? Um, what we do is we use um, the power of football um, to, to promote safe drinking water, sanitation and hygiene in Africa. Um, and in the future in other countries too. What we do is um, uh, we develop um, football-based games and materials um, to educate children um, and adolescents about the importance of safe drinking water, sanitation and hygiene and facilitate um, behavior change. Um, we advocate for um, the right to water and sanitation with political decision makers um, and we um, tackle the rules related to sanitation and um, um, attempt to, to um, create demand for sanitation services. Yeah. That we do by, by using football as such in games, in materials, um, yeah. positive football based messaging but then also as you can see some of um, the biggest stars um, in the game like Steven Apia, um, Ghana's captain, um, Bastian Schweinsteiger from Germany. Dietje Drogba, current African Football of the Year, who have decided to join the Wash United Club because we are a social club and which yeah. everybody can join and act as champions for safe drinking water, sanitation and hygiene for all in Africa. So what's the reaction be like from people, from... I know you work with school children, yeah, yeah. And, but also I know politicians have been interested in... Well, football has proven like an, an enormously successful door opener. I mean, especially on sanitation, which remains a touchy issue, especially with political decision makers. Um, we have played this game, which is now a miniature version that we take to, to schools, the World Toilet Cup, um, at a number of political events, including Africa Water Week. And um, we were surprised um, how well it helped to break the ice with political decision makers, who then with us played the game, which I can also explain to you, so you understand the about it. So actually here is a little football pitch and here is a target goal game but instead of like a normal hole you have a latrine slab and a toilet seat and the yeah. game is called the World Toilet Cup. Now if you look at the ball it's also not your usual black and white football but this is brown and you have flies sitting on it which leads to the following conclusion that this is in fact a shit ball. So by playing this game you make an effort to getting the poo in the loo, to getting the shit where it should go in the World Toilet Cup. Score. So, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah I've, I've practiced a bit. But actually, this playful way has, has really helped us like, to, to get into talks um, with political decision makers, especially on sanitation. And after we do that with them, then we, we're building the advocacy on it. So actually, what you do after somebody played the game, we admit them to our club, we take the picture, as a champion for WASH with the messages that water and sanitation is a human right um, and that is advocacy material that all of us can use, that the sector can use to engage political decision makers again who have then positioned themselves. Cool. So um, that's really, really interesting. So what's your name again? Thorsten. Thorsten. Okay. Thank you very much for your Most help. Most welcome. <laughs> that's really cool.